Like, why, what's the reason why you've been homeless? Because you're in a hostel and... And... This makes a bad... Bad... Dying. Mm -hmm. Like... And then... My fellow there got part of a syringe. Mm -hmm. The boss was hand around. They never hand around. Alright? So we left the hostel. That's why we're on the streets now. How long have you been in the street? Like living living in the street? Um oh since we're gone out there what? We're gone out there a few weeks. A few weeks? Yeah, yeah. I'm lying on the we're lying on the footpath. Yeah, I'm lying pregnant, I thought they were pregnant. Okay. And did they offer you any accommodation, like emergency accommodation? No, they wouldn't even give me my money back. They wouldn't even give me my closet back. They wouldn't give me my money back. I didn't stay there. You wouldn't give me my pass back. Mm -hmm. did, did they pay you at the moment yeah. some social way for like support? Yeah. Like payments? Yeah, yeah but do you employ yeah and like less I was in for 65 euro a week. Mm -hmm. And I paid that but I never stayed there. Mm -hmm. I was supposed to get that back and I was supposed to get um the what you call it? The pause the back? The pause, the pause never give you a back. Take, take, take. Don't give. Don't give. Did, did, you, did, you not, uh, did you notify the Dublin City Council that you are pregnant? Like, did you let, let them know that you have been pregnant? No, I'm pregnant, yeah. And a few people in the same place got food poisoned. And there's, there's um, rats in the kitchen. They have all rat traps in the presses and all. Mm -hmm. like, and they have people knocking at your door all the time and it's horrible. It's, it's a very hard place to stay, is it? Yeah, and they keep, keep on checking you every three years. It does sound nice. Mm -hmm. Even you sleeping, they check you at night time? Every uh, three hours. Even you at night time after yeah, 12? Every three hours. That's every three hours. Okay, that's not. Uh, and is it much assault happen in those places like assault and, 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 and just steal your stuff? Is it happen. Assault happen in the in the shelters, homeless shelters? It's a lot more happening, yeah. It's like do something about it, it's wrong. You find yourself not safe to stay there, is it? No. Especially when you're pregnant. Um, did, did, did the WCT Council actually contact you? Some reprints approach you say, listen, because you're pregnant, you will have a child staying no. in the street. No, no, no. Never? No. No. Uh, we don't care. We don't care. Did, when are you last time been... Uh, do you have paperwork that you've been pregnant? Like, do you have able to prove it that you've been pregnant like from the doctor? Oh, yeah. yeah from Austin, yeah. Okay. Yeah, I am three months. Okay. Um, uh, okay, the station is here. Do you think... Um, did you ever try to write them a letter saying that you're spending your situation that you are pregnant and you need an emergency accommodation for long-term accommodation? They do not give a They don't care. Just... Yeah, give me an opportunity to speak. They don't care. Okay. What do you think, if I am able to write a letter for you on your behalf, that you're pregnant and you need emergency accommodation. You're, you're, it's your, you're single or you have a partner. It's my partner. This is your, your, it's your partner. Um, do you think if we write a letter that you're pregnant and you need emergency accommodation and you're able to prove that you yeah, kind yeah, of paperwork? Yeah. yeah. Um, uh, get the paperwork, yeah. Yeah. My, my suggestion is to you. Did you able to write and read? I can you write, but a small, can write, read small bit. You have problems with reading and writing? I left school when I was 11. When you was 11? Yeah. So you have problems with uh, reading and read. writing? Just, just read. And, and are you able to write? Yeah. Okay. Okay. <clears throat> um, Jason, you think if, if I, for example, make a letter on your behalf stating that you need emergency accommodation and you are pregnant, and send to W City Council, where you stay over now usually, where you sleep or? I'm sleeping on the footpath. Where? On the footpath. And on which street? Like, yeah, which street? Uh, yeah. Nobody I like is. Yeah. Sleeping on the footpath there. Yeah.
were Dalek in the foot pattern. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Um, he will go snores with sleeping there. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And the other mm -hmm. so, But you said you've been a couple of weeks or you've been years homeless? A couple of weeks out of that place. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Now Brown, it's a kid. It's a dirty place. The rooms are filthy. The walls are filthy. To get me a quilt, I lift up the I lift up the mattress and there's a big pool of blood in the mattress. Like that's disgusting. Big pool of blood. Did you complain about it? About yeah, I complained about and it. And what happened? You just tell me to turn around, you know what? Oh my god. Okay. So there is no res no dignity and respect. No, no, no. No people need to go up and have a look at the at the place. What, how this place is called? Mount Brown. Mount Brown is a is a home for homeless shelter. Yeah, people need to go up and have a look at the rooms and all, and it's, it's bad. You think safety inspectors, health and safety yeah, inspectors, yeah, are supposed to be standing there? Yeah, need to look at the rooms and all. Yeah. They put me in the room that my my double first cousin died. I'm in the first. Put her to this. They got me another room upstairs then because I wanted to get out of there. It's just too many members. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay, um, do you think if you if you give me your details and you give me your permission to write a letter and you give me a phone number, I gonna write a letter. Phone number, phone number, yeah, number, yeah. So. On your on your behalf. Yeah, living. You can drop it into the analytic. Yeah. I focus Ireland. Because we need you need to outline your position to Dublin City Council that you're pregnant, you need accommodation, emergency accommodation. Yeah, yeah, that is. Uh, you know, that's that's the point. And uh, so, do you like that I will write a letter for you on your behalf? Yeah. If you provide me your personal details, GPS number, and I'm gonna write them a letter. And did you? Wh what places you actually going yourself? I'll just give it a minute. Yeah, you can give it later. It's okay. Um, do you think uh, homelessness is increased in comparison to last year? Nah, it's getting worse and worse. Worse and worse. Yeah, they're not doing it. They're not doing it. Mm -hmm. And do you think suicide rate yeah, and depression is? Yeah, yeah. Loads of people kill themselves. Loads of girls kill themselves. All young girls kill themselves. It's about 30 young girls in the last three months kill themselves. I knew every one of them. Friends of mine. Yeah. Suicide. Just, just didn't want to live. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, what do you think it's it's leads to the homelessness? What's the reason would be causing that leads to the homelessness? The homelessness is just, With COVID-19, everything got changed in, 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 in some way in relation to attitudes towards homelessness and depression. Suicide rate has increased with COVID-19 as well. There's legs. It's almost, yeah. It's almost, yeah. People are fucking themselves in the river. Bodies are getting took out. Yeah. How, they got, how actually guard treats you when you've been in the street? Like shit. They call me names and all. The call your names. Yeah, they come out with dirty language, dirty words, like, like, uh, sex, what's you call it? What's that? Calling me, uh, as, no, it's calling me names and all, it's sexual names. Guys are the ones, the ass not the sex. No, I uh, dirty things. The only thing is I need to talk with people. There's a guy that wants to bring the stuff to the school. We've got messages from Gloria, and then the guy did that in the back of the van.